A $10,000 grant is helping a pair of educators at Indiana State show how music can teach math skills. It's a study they've been working on since the fall. Our research has shown that for years the two factors actually relate, but it's hard to show you how. In tonight's Education Watch 10, News 10's Sarah Schaefer has more on this group's effort to show the relationship between music and math. One, two, three, let's go. Kirk Moore is from Ghana, Africa. He says living in a small village as a child, he had to find ways to learn. We didn't pretty much have video games or Legos or anything. So you had to play with anything you had your hands on. Um, so what I did is just take a piece of wood, just be hitting on it, and then for some reason I started having fun with it. And now he's helping students do the same thing. He's doing it through a study the college is conducting to show how music can teach math skills. I think it's best that whatever you lay your hands on, whatever that's around, around you, I think every human being or every person has an obligation to know what they are dealing with, who they are relating with, as well as their environment. So he's meeting with middle school students for 90 minutes twice a week, something one of the organizers of the study says she's positive has an impact. I'm convinced that art, the arts have positive influences in adults and children, and I've seen um, changes in people firsthand while working with them. As for Kirk Moore, he's convinced the way he learned his skills will continue to be common ground through numbers and notes. In Terre Haute with photojournalist Cody Murphy, I'm Sarah Schaefer, News 10. The students will be tested on their math skills again in May to see how and if the music made a difference. Very nice.